chloroplast structure and genome. What is chloroplast? Chloroplast is a large ellipsoid-shaped organelle that serves as the site of photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is the process by which solar energy is converted into chemical energy, resulting in the production of oxygen, ADP, and glucose. Chloroplasts are found in the cells of green plants and certain algae. They are concentrated particularly in the mesophyll layer of green plants. The green coloration comes from a light-trapping pigment known as chlorophyll. Endosymbiotic theory strongly suggests that chloroplasts are descendants of oxygen-producing cyanobacterium that were endocytosed. Chloroplast is surrounded by endoplasmic reticulum in some algae and some primitive eukaryotes. Chloroplast is bounded by single endoplasmic reticulum membrane in dinoflagellates and eugolnoids. Chloroplast bounded by two endoplasmic reticulum membranes are found in pheophyta, cryptophyta, and chrysophyta. Rubisco is the marker enzyme of chloroplast. Here are some of the morphological features of chloroplast. It is a double-membraned organelle with a narrow intermembrane space in between the outer and inner layers. Stromules are the tubular structures that connects chloroplasts with each other. They function in exchange of materials between the chloroplasts. Chloroplast contains three distinct membranes, outer membrane, inner membrane, and thylakoid membrane. Let us have a detailed look at the overall structure of plant chloroplast with an illustrative picture. This is the outer membrane, which is much more permeable than the inner membrane, which features a number of embedded membrane transport proteins. The area between the outer and inner layers of the chloroplast envelope is called the intermembrane space. These hollow discs, called thylakoids, which are usually arranged into tight stacks, called grana. Thylakoids are usually dispersed throughout the matrix, known as stroma. The neighboring grana are connected by unstacked stromal thylakoids, called stromal lamellae. Now, let's brief out the structural composition of chloroplasts, which includes outer membrane. The outer layer of the chloroplast contains porins and is therefore highly permeable to small molecules. In contrast, the inner membrane is impermeable to ions and metabolites. The transport is more restricted to certain proteins that can enter chloroplasts via specific membrane transporters. One of the most distinctive features of chloroplast is its thylakoid membrane. It is the third complex internal membrane that encompasses the chloroplast envelope. This membrane houses different protein complexes, including photosystem 1, photosystem 2, and ADP synthase, which are specialized for light-dependent photosynthesis. Chlorophylls Thylakoid membrane constitutes 10% phospholipids, 80% galactolipids like monogalactosildiacylglycerol, digalactosildiacylglycerol, and 10% sulfolipids like sulfoquinovacildiacylglycerol. Nextly, stroma. It is the aqueous fluid that lies between the inner membrane and the thylakoid membrane. Dark reaction of photosynthesis takes place in the stroma. This matrix contains a variety of metabolic enzymes, starch granules, 70S ribosomes, tRNAs, transcription and translation factors, multiple copies of chloroplast DNA. Thylakoid lumen is the central aqueous region that is enveloped by a thylakoid membrane. Grana. The thylakoid membrane is extensively folded and characterized by the presence of flattened disc-like sacs, called thylakoids, which are frequently organized in tight stacks called grana. Grana contains chlorophyll pigment, responsible for light reaction of photosynthesis. Stroma lamellae, otherwise called fret lamellae. These are membrane extensions that run from one granum into a neighboring granum and dispersed throughout the stroma. Chloroplast genome or plastome. Chloroplast genomes are larger, ranging from 120 to 160 kb in length. Multiple copies of circular DNA molecules are found in each organelle. However, recent research indicates that the genome of chloroplast may be linear. The region where DNA molecules form a cluster is called chloroplast nucleoid. Chloroplast genes are organized into operons and do not contain introns. 
chloroplast encodes atrazine or triazine herbicide resistance. Most of the chloroplast proteins are encoded by nuclear genes and are moved into the chloroplast via complex import machinery. Genes encoded by chloroplast DNA Approximately 120 to 130 genes are present in chloroplast that encode both RNAs and proteins involved in gene expression, besides diverse proteins that function in photosynthesis. Genes for genetic apparatus are listed in this table. Both the ribosomal and transfer RNAs used for translation of chloroplast mRNAs are encoded by the chloroplast genome. It also encodes about 21 ribosomal proteins and 4 subunits of RNA polymerase. Additional RNA polymerase subunits and other factors required for chloroplast gene expression are encoded in the nucleus. Followingly, the genes for photosynthesis are listed in this table. Chloroplast DNA encodes approximately 30 proteins that are involved in photosynthesis, including components of photosystems 1 and 2, cytochrome BF complex, and ADP synthase. It also encodes one of the subunits of Rubisco. Additionally, chloroplast genomes contain another 30 genes that are not listed here. A couple of these genes encode proteins involved in respiration, although most of them remain unidentified. Thank you for watching. Please do like and share this video. Also, click on the subscribe button and hit on the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos.